Alrighty, guys. What's going on? We're back. Uh, so, as you can tell from the title of the video, today uh, we're going to be skating around and we're going to be talking about the time that I fractured my skull. Now, uh, I didn't fracture my skull today or anytime recently or even on skates, as a matter of fact. It was a while ago, so uh, I'm not trying to clickbait you into watching this video. Uh, this is just a story. So, um, yeah, uh, a little bit about the session. Uh, we're using three-wheel setup. Uh, I'll talk a little bit about the video if I see something that I need to. Uh, the three wheels are really hard to use uh, because they're, they're huge. They're ginormous, and you only have three of them instead of the normal four. So uh, you got to skate a lot differently. I'm not really used to them yet. Um, you could see in a few times of the video where I uh, kind of take things a little bit slow and I'm a little cautious just because I'm not used to them. Uh, they take a lot more balance to stay up on uh, because they're so big. Anyways, let's talk about this story. So, little little uh, brief backstory first. Um, I'm from Las Vegas, Nevada. I'm sure most of everybody knows where that is. Uh, it's a desert. It's extremely hot there. So, um, in the summer... You know, we go swimming all the time, and uh, well, we go swimming all the time. This is back in I think fourth or fifth grade. I was either in fourth or fifth grade, and uh, we had this neighbor, and his name was Carl. Because you know, pools are expensive and they take a lot to upkeep and stuff. So we didn't actually have our own pool, but uh, we would always go over to our neighbor Carl's house and uh, just swim over there. He was a nice guy, really old guy. He was married to another old woman, and. Uh, you know, they were really cool and let us uh, swim over there all the time. And I remember this one summer, uh, I was trying to learn how to do backflips because at the time, I could do front flips, you know. Front flips were no problem. Yeah, I could do them off the diving board. I could do them into the pool. I could do them on trampolines and stuff like that. I was pretty athletic. Uh, but I couldn't do uh, backflips, really, because they kind of, I don't know, they just threw me off. They were weird. And so this one summer, I was trying to learn how to do backflips, and uh, it was the first day I was, like, really practicing, and I finally had gotten, like, one backflip down. And I was, like, so excited. So, you know, of course, I wanted to keep doing more backflips and stuff, and uh, I ended up doing a backflip and landing right on the smack dab on the top of my head on the side of the pool. So I literally did a backflip and landed straight upright and landed on my head. But the funny thing is, is that I had no idea I was even hurt until after the fact. I thought I had completed the whole backflip. <laughs> I was like, I did my thing, you know, and I was in the water next thing I know. And I pop out of the water and everybody's freaking out, like rushing over to me. And I'm like, what's going on? Like, did you guys see the backflip? <laughs> and uh, apparently I was bleeding pretty badly because uh, they put a towel over my head. And uh, man, there's just blood everywhere. It was pretty crazy. And, uh, man, I remember I was just was so dreading going to the hospital because I did not want to have to get stitches. When I was that young, stitches, like, were the scariest thing to me. I don't know why. I just hated that idea of having to get stitches. But now looking back on it, I wish I did get stitches because what ended up happening was they had to put six staples into my head, which was not very fun. So they stapled my head back together, and I think after, like, a month, I was all ready and good to go. Yeah, it's it's pretty messed up. Uh, I wouldn't recommend doing backflips unless uh, you're really comfortable at doing them. They're not good to do on the side of the pool either. <laughs> uh, let me know if you guys have any ideas of what I can talk about. Uh, anything like that comes to your mind, just leave a comment down below. Uh, uh, and also, thanks to uh, you're watching some skaters skate right now. I was at the skate park and they let me film them. Thank you to you guys. Uh, hopefully, I can have another one out tomorrow. Peace.